what's up viewers and subscribers welcome back to my thoughts tv alleged gun smuggler l at party a man described as the mastermind behind the illegal importation of 21 guns into the island in march was arrested in ochiraya saint Anne yesterday the man whose identity is being with l pending formal charges being laid was arrested by personnel from the Counter-Terrorism and Organized Crime CTAC investigation branch at a party in the parish. Detectives said that the man has been on their radar for some time and his arrest follows months of investigation that features several lines of inquiry, 18 handguns, 3 rifles, and a large catch of ammunition were seized by the police at a warehouse in Kingston on March 4. The fine was made when personnel from Jamaica custom noticed anomalies with a package and calling CTAC. Yes, when the police them are do them work, you have to commend them. Yes, when they're not doing them work, I will be the first one to bash them. And in this case, they are do them work because this man here is a big drugs dealer. He might import a lot of guns in our country and I supply a lot of gangs. So the fact that the police them take him off a street, the fact that them seize a lot of guns, it is a good look because the more guns come off a street, you know, that now I gonna reduce crime and I don't want to see. Even though I feel like say Uncle Sam was behind this because this man here him did in a Uncle Sam place and them dip him and because him did in a Uncle Sam place him have a lot of links and him use him links them and import the guns them in a country wonder how it passed custom but he import guns in a country and supply a lot of gangs plus him is a drugs dealer and as a drugs dealer you don't have it in a one country if you push drugs in that country you can't have foot soldiers who are do your dirty work and I feel like say I that him do and Uncle Sam investigate, realize say him is behind all of that. Them link up with Jamaica security force to capture him. Them capture him and I feel like say them are gonna extradite him. That's how I feel because big operation like this. My observation because I don't know if that ever happened, but me never see it happen yet. You see big top man who I make a lot of money and police run operation and crack down on that criminal network and never yet Jamaica de behind it always Uncle Sam only the little fries them like the little scammer them who I make some little money and them I import guns and I do a lot of crime and them little fries there and you see when them capture these fries they make it seem like say them I do them work which is the big top man them who I do more damage them turn a blind eyes to these men because these men I make more money and them I tap up them pocket because these men know say if them have couple politicians na them pocket and them have couple police na them pocket it better for them nobody not going to intervene so all the times them when we see big operation like this I always uncle Sam they behind it and it is not a good look and why anytime you hear about extradition I always uncle Sam link up with Jamaica security force to take criminals who are affect their country and extradite them to face them courts why Jamaica cannot do the same thing because a lot of criminals overseas you know i fund these gangs you know and i make them stronger you know and jamaicans them now send for these criminals you know them they overseas and them are enjoy life and them are live a good life meanwhile then they overseas and i mash up jamaica and a jamaica it a affect you know and jamaica leaders they now send for these criminals it is not a good look and the next thing, how me know say Jamaica system is very corrupt. This drugs dealer, him have lice a firearm. It can't get more corrupted because a law abiding citizen, you know, a person who want to protect him family life and protect fame life, you know, him can't get a firearm so easy, you know, him have to go through this and that. And what me observe, what me realize, a lot of criminals because them have money, them a get lice a firearm easy, easy, easy. So things like this show say the system is very corrupt. Even though I feel like say Uncle Sam they behind it or whatsoever, 
it no matter if a Uncle Sam and it no matter if a Jamaica. The fact that in come off high street, well, one less links for these gangs. And that better for Jamaica overall. It no matter who they behind it, for capture this man here, me just want to say him get captured, me just want to say gun get seized, and I that I want to see. You guys can leave on the thoughts in the comment section. Anyways, if you guys like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share and turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss the next upload. I'm out.